This morning, we're diving into the proposed state budget lawmakers have agreed on. This comes two days before the end of the regular session, but what really matters is what does it mean for you? ABC Action News reporter Vanessa Ariza joining us in studio this morning with the breakdown on that. Vanessa. Good morning to you, James. You know, this isn't the end all be all. Governor Ron DeSantis still has to sign off on it. This is kind of a summary of what it details. So let's kind of break it down for you just a little bit more. There is a $1,000 raise for teachers as well as first responders. In it as well, $1.8 billion for environmental programs. That includes $100 million for the former Piney Point Phosphate uh, Mining Area for the cleanup there. Now that is contingent if the state receives the federal COVID funding that it was promised. So that's also not an end all be all there. And there's also $6 billion that's left in the reserves. So a lot of information in there. We're going to be posting the summary for you on our website abcactionnews.com. That way, if you want to take a deeper dive into it, a lot of numbers there, and we will continue to fill you in. At the end of the day, though, the governor still has to sign off on this. James. All right, Vanessa, thanks for breaking that down for us.